Hey, Mustangs, uh, Mr. Madrich here, and uh, welcoming you to a new school year uh, remotely. Um, we're excited to get started on Monday, and I just wanted to take a minute to uh, welcome you and, and uh, try to outline the process of, you know, logging onto your Chromebook, ClassLink, and Schoology for uh, your kiddos, and then the parent account for Schoology so you can view their classes. So um, during distribution, um, you receive your, your materials, student materials, books, um, a Chromebook if, if you requested one right now, and then a packet that contains all the login information and how to do that, what I'm, what I'm basically gonna outline here in this process. So I'm gonna share my screen to kind of help me out here. Um, but when you get your Chromebook, um, you shouldn't have to sign in. The ones that we actually looked at, uh, the kids don't have to enter their credentials in to sign in. You just hit the arrow, it says VLE student, you hit the arrow and it should take you to this page. If you have to sign in, you're gonna use your student's Gmail address and password that's included in the, in the packet that you will uh, get on Wednesday and Thursday. Um, and that's you know the kid's password if they forgot it. Um, so you can do it a couple of ways there. Um, but once you get in, you should see this screen. It's the launch pad um, and it, it's a sign in to class link. Class link's kind of like uh, a cell phone. I'd like to relate it to, you know, on your cell phone, you have the apps on the screen and you're able just to access those different applications by just clicking on the button. And that's kind of what class link is. It's kind of an easy way for the kiddos to access all the programs that they're going to be using uh, with remote learning. So there's two ways to do this. Um, one, you can just do it the old fashioned way, sign in with, with your Google account. So if you click on that button, it's going to take you to the sign in page. And right here, you're just going to enter your kiddos um, credentials provided in the packet that you receive to get in. Okay, so that's one way. Um, the other way would be using uh, this QR button here. It doesn't really tell you what it is, but it's called a quick card. Um, it uses a QR code. Um, so if you click on it, it's going to take you to a screen um, that has a, a camera come up and you're going to use your kiddos QR code like that. You can see how fast that happened. And it just logs you right into class link. Okay. So this is what class link looks like. Um, like I said, it's kind of like a cell phone. You have your apps there. You know, she has Schoology, their Gmail, um, PowerSchool, BrainPop, um, iReady, Lexia. Those programs that are going to be utilized during remote learning are on class link which makes it very easy because once you're in, you don't necessarily have to provide credentials to log into anything else. So from there, uh, if a kiddo wants to get on their Schoology, they just go hover above the Schoology and click on that, and it will take them right into Schoology. So they're in, it's pretty simple. Um, once uh, the teachers get their uh, open house videos posted, I will post those along with this video and they will walk you through um, their classes, the layout, um, what to expect from their courses on Schoology. But that's basically how the kiddos get on the Schoology. Um, it all starts from when you open up your Chromebook, you have that launch pad and um, logs you into ClassLink. From ClassLink, you can get to Schoology. Um, in addition to that, we also have a parent uh, Schoology account. Um, so you get to that by going to www.schoology.com and it will take you to this website right here. Okay, www.schoology.com. Um, in the packet, I know I keep showing the packet, but in the packet, you'll have your uh, kiddos access code uh, for the parent account as well. And it's just listed there um, for you to use. So you're gonna go over to the right-hand side up here and it says sign up. You're gonna sign up as a parent. So if I click on parent, it's gonna take me to the sign up for Schoology here. As you can see, I'm gonna enter that access code in here. And I have my, I'll use my son Jack. Um, that's his access code. And then you're just gonna type in their first name, last name, their Gmail, um, and then if you um, want to create a password so you can get in and out, you can do that. And you register for that uh, parent account in this way so you can monitor their school. So So um, just wanted to provide that for you guys, just a quick uh, video that kind of outlines it. It's, it's pretty simple. 
you know, I know none of this, none of these things right now are, are easy, but um, hopefully this makes your life a little bit easier. Um, again, you're going to receive this packet um, during distribution and it, it just has all the information about what I just said, outlines how to get into the uh, parent account. Um, if you have any issue with this, don't panic. You know, there's even on Monday, if you're trying to log in, you can't get in, call the school, um, email Mr. Gooch, our librarian, uh, dgooch at districtfamily.org. He can help you. Email me, call the office, and we can help you get in. Um, so just uh, reach out to us. We're here for you guys during this process um, with logins, uh, computer help, tech issues, and just let us know, and we'll, we'll be glad to, to help you out with that. So. Uh, hope this works for you guys. Um, if you have any questions, just let us know. Hope you guys have a great remote learning. Thanks. Bye.